How's it going guys? My name is Josh Annis. This is our homestead model. It's 32 feet by eight and a half feet. We are the designers and builders of this. So I'd like to give you guys a quick little walkthrough detailing the materials and kind of the layout and how we designed to build this thing. On this side of the trailer, we have shiplap, 10 inch shiplap with uh, copper metal siding. We use all black vinyl windows. This is the kitchen window. There's a half quarter quarter. Both end sashes open into the middle. Over here we have the bathroom window, which is a form of exhaust. It's inside of the shower. Um, moving to the front of the trailer, we have a large picture frame window up in the loft. And then the mini split condensing unit is mounted on the neck of the trailer. This trailer was purchased out of Oregon for uh, about $9,000. It is a triple axle trailer. It can support around 21,000 gross value weight. Moving back to the rear, um, I'm honestly very excited about just the quality of materials that we used on this trailer in its entirety on the outside. I wanted to ensure that there was a lot of natural light in this entire build, hence why we decided to put a lot of large picture frame windows and skylights on the inside. On this back side, we used a six foot wide by eight foot tall Anderson glass sliding door. And then on this side of the trailer, we utilized some hardy board instead of some shiplap. I kind of wanted to give the trailer a little bit of character considering it's small. Um, we have a nice little access door for a dog right here. And then um, we've got black hardy board siding with a large picture frame window, again with our copper siding. Moving to the inside into the living room, we decided to use um, some black ceramic hexagon style flooring. In the living room, we have a nice armoire here for his and hers clothing. We have a lot of shiplap up on the walls. It allows these five skylights to really reflect their natural lighting. These three skylights are smaller than the fourth, or excuse me, the fifth skylight. These are all fixed. The skylight over the loft is four feet by four feet, and it does manually open for a form of egress as well. Moving into the kitchen, we have a really nice three quarter inch hickory flooring. We used black quartz countertops with a black stainless steel sink with a black kitchen faucet. We have nice white shaker cabinets in the kitchen, 84 inch uh, pantry cabinet right here. Moving back towards the restroom, we have a stackable washer and dryer and a black stainless steel Samsung fridge that come with the trailer as well. Into the bathroom, we have a smaller hexagon, hexagon style flooring and shiplap on the back wall. We used a lot of black tile in here, a very modern bathroom. We used a nice glass sliding door um, and there's also two twin 12 inch shower heads with him and hers valves as well. So very happy with how this bathroom turned out. Moving upstairs into the loft, we use a one, one inch hickory tread with a bunch of storage underneath of the stairs to be utilized for clothing, um, laundry materials, towels, things of that nature, whatever you decide to use it for. But um, the loft itself extends out 10 feet somewhat over the kitchen and it is eight feet wide, allowing you to put a California King style mattress up there. There is a large picture frame window on the back side, which allows a lot of natural light to come into the tiny house, which also has blinds in case you decide that you want a little privacy up in your bed. The TV also comes with the tiny house and uh, there are candle lights that run the full length of the trailer which added a lot of really nice lighting. So this build took about four months in its entirety and it is listed at $125,999. It can be yours today. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to Roy with Tiny House Listings for inquiries. Once again, guys, this house did not take any shortcuts in the build. We used premium materials in here and we're very happy with how it turned out. So please feel free to reach out and don't hesitate to shoot an offer. Thanks. Have a good day.